Meet Dr. Chpomotsk, South Africa's new first lady. President Cyril Ramaphosa has kept his personal life with his second wife and family extremely private, but now South Africa wants to meet them. Cyril Ramaphosa was sworn in as South Africa's president yesterday in Cape Town, and for the first time, many South Africans are realizing they know very little about his personal life. Some don't even know the name of his wife yet, Dr. Chpomotsk sister of business mogul Patrice Motz. The new first lady has a list of qualifications as long as former President Jacob Zuma's charge sheet. She holds an MBCHB from the University of KwaZulu-Natal, that means she's a medical doctor. She also did a Master's of Public Health at prestigious Harvard University in the U.S. In addition, she completed a certificate course in the Social Entrepreneurship Certificate Program at the Gordon Institute of Business Science, GIBS. Besides a career in which she has worked in hospitals in South Africa and Zimbabwe, the First Lady is a philanthropist. She is a patron of the South African Civil Society for Women's, Adolescents and Children's Health. Saksawak, a former board member at the Val Reefs Disaster Trust, and has also served on the board of the Kids Haven Foundation. She is guided by the belief that economic and social development is a prerequisite for communities to lead socially and economically productive lives, as stated in the World Health Organization's Alda Ada Declaration of 1978. She and the President have four children, one of them is Tumelo, a businessman like his dad. He attended Street Stithians College, then completed undergraduate studies at Damillon and his master's at Hult International Business School. He went on to be a business consultant for fast food chain McDonald's South Africa. Tumelo started Studex Wildlife, which uses Studex coin, a cryptocurrency based on endangered species conservation, which aims to protect them from hunting, poaching, predators and disease. Our new first lady is also stylish, witness her two-piece Thula Sindhi Ensemble in Parliament on Thursday for her husband's swearing-in as president.